oh my God, I didn't have any hope at that moment. When you're homeless and you're looking for a place um, or and you're couch surfing, it's really hard to make good decisions. I was on the street with my kids. My only hope was Family Promise. It's an emergency shelter program for families experiencing homelessness, and we utilize host sites such as churches and colleges that actually put the families up for a week at a time. Family Promise is set up to make the transition from being homeless to finding uh, permanent housing a lot more smooth. They provide meals for you, which is really helpful. They give us a place to sleep, our bed, our children's bed, all family together. It was very good. Actually, the first dinner that we had, I was super nervous. Didn't want my kids sitting at the table with their elbows on the table. Every time you get there, everybody have a nice smile on their face, you know. You are part of the family, so you're welcome. And the volunteers, they're very helpful and very sweet and considerate. I tell people that it's something you can do, take a couple hours of your week, four times a year, and make a difference. This agency would not exist without the thousands of people on the North Shore that are giving their time and their money towards our efforts. People realize they're just like me. These are just people who, for some reason, one thing led to another, led to another, led to another, and they find themselves in their car. Everybody was relaxed. We were laughing. We got to our room and my daughter turned to me and she said, Mom, this is good. This isn't going to be bad. We are working with a population of people who've experienced a tremendous trauma. Losing your housing and not knowing where you're going to sleep the next night is a trauma unlike anything that you know I'll ever be able to imagine. So we went in. We had separate beds now, which was good. Um, and I slept solid the best sleep I'd had in two years. Everybody in family promise are great. I really appreciate them. The, the guidelines are strict, so you need to be ready to make those changes and follow along with the schedule, which can be rough, but you get used to it. All of our guests feel that we have faith in them, but also know that we're going to be tough. But at the same time, you know, we have to counter that with compassion and make sure everyone knows that at the end of the day, if they fail at a job interview, they can come back and tell us and we're going to still be proud of, th of them. I think that we focus a lot on strength-based approaches and, and really reaffirming the clients in their own strengths. They help so much with resources like food stamp benefits or health insurance, looking for work, applying for apartments. The transportation piece is huge. My daughter had a, she got her first like summer internship type of a thing. We couldn't get her there and they figured out a way. A lot of things have changed. I've been at the same job for a while now, which so I've been able to get like completely stable. Now I'm able to have a car, an apartment, a stable job. I have a husband, a new baby. Like, you know, what else could you ask? I worked so hard. I worked my butt off. Like, it's gonna make me cry. So yeah, but they, they just totally like changed my life. It gave me a lot of like uh, strength and Julie is awesome and she advocated for me like the whole way and she's a great woman. For every victory you know there's 10 people that are still struggling and we have to remind ourselves of that so we keep pushing and keep fighting but I think stories like guests that have made it through our program and have remained housed and you know it, it proves that sometimes it really is just a leg up um, that can get people back on their feet. Supporting Family Promise is a really good investment for anyone that may have some extra money. <laughs> um, it would really help them out and they totally deserve it. Thank you.